Hey, Eric Sider here, and in this video, I'm gonna be uh, potting up some comfrey. Just got a fresh off the first thing smoking from Permapastures Farm and some of their amazing pimp drip honey. Uh, quick shout out to all the uh, new subscribers who came over from their channel, and if you're not subscribed, definitely get over there and check out what's happening in Permapastures Farm. They're a uh, quintessential awesome representation of permaculture. They're uh, basically farming on the side of a mountain in North Carolina. Uh, Billy, the permaculture pimp, his son William, wife Michelle, they're killing it. Perfect representation of one of the key principles of permaculture that too often people overlook or discard, and that's cooperation, not competition. So. Let's get on to it. Uh, I got this awesome bag of comfrey, and if you saw the, uh, the last garden update I did, you'll know that uh, my comfrey from my root barrier did not come up, so I think it's just too extreme heat and uh, out there so what I'm gonna do normally you can just chuck these in the ground and they're gonna grow no problem but uh, out here it's just too damn hot and too damn dry so what I'm gonna do is start it in this uh, flat of potting mix and in about a month it should uh, it should start growing now this I just had this lying around so any uh, anything that holds soil and moisture <laughs> will do the job so I got uh, way more than I can probably fit out there. Uh, definitely more than I can fit in here. So let's uh, dump these out. And if you're in need of comfrey or you want some amazing honey, uh, definitely check them out. They got comfrey for sale. So you got these nice big roots. These will all, all root. And then I got plenty of extra of these smaller guys. And most likely these guys will root as well. So. All I'm going to do is just uh, make a little hole and start sticking these guys in there. And as long as they're covered by soil and you keep the moisture right uh, in about, like I said, more or less in about a month, they should uh, all be rooting and start growing. And then uh, depending on how hot it still is, I might uh, pop them right in the ground or uh, grow them out a little more in some and some pots. Typically comfrey because it's got such a deep taproot does not like to grow in pots. Um, you can do fabric pots which uh, as soon as the root hits the air they will uh, stop growing and send a new root out. So that's probably about the only way you can grow comfrey in a pot. All right so I got so I'm just gonna, since I got way more than I can fit in here, I'm just gonna take the best ones and stick them in there. And we'll uh, have to do another one for the rest of these. So pretty easy. Uh, if you're at all concerned about your comfrey growing, then uh, I definitely recommend this method. You'll for sure know if they're rooting. All right, cover that up. And look at that. I gotta, gonna need a whole nother one of these. All right, so quick and dirty. We'll uh, take this guy, pop it right on top, make sure we keep the moisture going. All right, and that's that. So uh, if you're enjoying these videos, uh, easiest way to support the channel, uh, like, share, subscribe. And uh, if you uh, like these shirts, uh, I'll put the link down at the bottom. Check those out. Again, big shout out to uh, Permapastures Farm and uh, the Permaculture Pimp for this awesome comfrey and amazing honey. All right. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.